This is a very simple snow sculpture that was made uh, with a container and just this. The big building like protrusions were just made by uh, stacking them and it's supposed to be the uh, Twin Towers. Here are some of the containers and tools we use to make the ice and snow slushy sculptures. Um, used a great big, used a standard size garbage can to make the snow arches and that was put down first and then these containers they were filled with uh, slushy icy snow and they were compacted with the mallet where you could use your hand or your foot, stomp with your foot. Uh, the mallets were good, stomped and compacted that ice and snow and uh, that made the pillars then you would put you would put the pillars on the left and right side of the garbage can and build an arch slowly just like the Romans did with stone and then fill in the cracks fill in the cracks with more snow and compact it and smooth it over and uh, the other containers were used for the smaller sculpture the safety cone made the tops of the castles that made a perfect pointed cone then this fluted uh, garbage can made a uh, made the uh, rivets or the columns, whatever the heck you call it, on the outside of the uh, castle that that made. Instead of making sand castles, they, Connor made a snow castle thing. Oh. For some reason, Connor put yellow polka dots all over his uh, ice uh, snow sculpture castle thingy, which kind of looks kind of odd. Which I wish I would have caught him. And fortunately, it's a light enough color because the risk you have when you do dark colors is that it melts uh, too fast. And here are the, uh, here's the snow arches, and here's my son for scale, that's my son Keegan for scale, and they were made, the whole opening is big enough to get the garbage can in. And this sculpture, which was to look like uh, skylines, city skylines. This, uh, this snow sculpture, ice sculpture, was made on top of the heaved uh, snow plow piles. And it's supposed to look like, it's supposed to be the twin, twin towers. It's melted after a few days. And that was made with uh, the clear octagon shaped uh, plastic container. So it's a little different than a, a snowman. It's just fun to make a different thing. You could, in theory, put uh, two more little arches right there and right there. They had to be real small. Uh, you could also put the head of a dragon here and the tail of a dragon there. So there's you could add on to this in different ways, but these are just a few of the possibilities. You'd, for, for a dragon head, you'd have to you might have to have some kind of wooden support because the head's going to want to fall off. But if you put a board in it that has like a slight L shape, put it into the ground, you could compact snow around it to get a dragon's head. Just a thought. Forty-two degrees today. The ice arches lasted about a week. It's forty-two and really melting fast. All things must pass.